You can see you now this is a big, large, wide vertical disc spinner going up against a more compact drum and wedge sort of multi bot configuration. Four, three, it's going to be interesting to see two, who starts winning that one, ground game and fight, what sort of games the multi bot plays here. You see Blue Marlin coming out aggressive. Big first hit sends them both flying. Thunderbolt come in and try to take advantage, but it's getting pinned behind the house robot here. Yeah, and really the, scary place to be. Blue Marlin, though, getting pinned by Thunderbolt's uh, second wedge components. Real good teamwork here, uh, getting underneath them and, and coming in with the hit. Yeah, absolutely beautiful strategy executed by a multi bot configuration. We've been seeing it all day. The that's... days of chaos and friendly fire are over. It is all about coordinated attacks now. Look oh, at that these shot. Hits are massive. Everyone is going flying and they keep going. Blue Marlin right back at it, trying to get that weapon into the side rails of Blue Marlin. Blue Marlin oh, sorry, here just seems to be ignoring Thunderbolt's wedge bot and going after the drum bot entirely. Another huge hit sending Blue Marlin flying. It, it might be smart to try to avoid going head to head with that thing. They've only got that slope in the front. Seems like Blue Marlin has lost their left side drive and their right side drive is stuck now on Thunderbolt's mini. Uh, but Thunderbolt's drum robot also has lost half of their drive. Yeah, these robots have taken massive hits already in this, in this fight. We're not even halfway through yet. Yeah, it has been massive hits. Uh, you can hear the spinners spun up. I'm just waiting for another uh, big bang to send them both cr flying across the arena. Having a little bit of targeting issues here on both sides. Thunderbolt with a bit more maneuverability than Blue Marlin, which is making it more difficult for Blue Marlin to connect with that weapon. Thunderbolt's weapon uh, seems to be down. The later we get into this tournament, the more attrition and damage the robots are going to be collecting. Yeah, absolutely. Look at this grind against the, the drum there. This has been a fairly tight fight so far. I haven't seen Thunderbolt's second component in a while, and that damage could count significantly uh, if it goes to judge's decision. Absolutely. So, you know, there is no distinction uh, between, you know, minibot and mainbot in terms of, of damage. You know, if one of your robots is, is broken, that's pretty much 50% damage. Um, so you don't want to go into a judge's decision with your the second half of your multi-bots uh, not moving. Beautiful pin there by Thunderbolt. Really impressive with their limited mobility in this part of the fight. Yeah, really good driving here on one wheel. That is not easy to do, but Blue Marlin is really getting it dialed in as this fight goes, learning how that robot moves with one wheel. Staying aggressive here at the end. All right, that is the end of this fight. This one will go to the judges, not how anybody wanted this fight to end, but I'd say they both did really well. Yeah, pretty back and forth there. Uh, difficult one to call. Judges will decide who goes into the semifinals in the next round. Okay, oh. your winner, Blue Marlin by judges' decision. Blue Marlin takes it. Moving on to the semifinals, congratulations. A unanimous one at Ooh. that.